I'm here to tell you about a much requested feature in the newest release of Cordian, MIDI mode. MIDI stands for Musical Instrument Digital Interface and is a way for electronic musical devices to communicate with each other by sending messages like play the note middle C. With Cordian's new MIDI mode, you can use the unique interface of Cordian to control any device that accepts MIDI input. To turn MIDI mode on, Navigate to the MIDI page via the sound editor. In MIDI mode, audio from Cordian's sound engine is disabled and MIDI messages will be generated instead. MIDI messages travel through ports on MIDI channels. In this case, let's use the virtual MIDI port, which allows us to send MIDI messages to other apps on the iPad. We'll set the MIDI channel to be channel 1. Let's open up one of our favorite music apps on the iPad, Animoog. In Animoog's setup screen, we can choose Cordian as the input device and set the input channel to be 1. Background audio also needs to be turned on. Let's go back to Cordian and see if it worked. The keyboard is now telling Animoog which notes to play. Pretty sweet! One unique thing about Cordian is that it allows you to play melodies with one hand while choosing chords with the other. We're using the keyboard to control Animoog, but let's set up the chord hexagons to output MIDI on channel 2. Then we can send MIDI notes from the chord buttons to another iPad synthesizer, Magellan. In Magellan, we navigate to the Preferences window, tap Inputs, and choose Cordian. Then set the Synth 1 input channel to be channel 2. We also need to make sure that background audio is turned on. And there you have it. Chords played by Magellan and lead lines played by Animoog, both controlled by Cordian. Have fun!